Hi everyone, my name is Nikita. I'm studying in grade six. Hi everybody, my name is Alvita, and I'm studying in grade six. Alvita, can I ask you a question? Sure, go ahead. Why can't the earthworm stand erect as we do? I will try, but I, can I ask you another question? Sure. Why can't cockroach? Why is cockroach not hard as our body? Interesting, right? Yes. So I think it's because of the skeleton. The skeleton system is a framework of bones, uh, and it helps gives support to our body and helps us to stand erect. Do you know some functions of the skeletal system? Sure. I will tell the functions of the skeletal system. The functions of the skeletal system are movement, protection, support, and the blood cell production and that's it. Okay, so do you know what is a joint? No. Can you brief me about them? Yeah, sure. Joints are the parts where two bones meet. Do you know the two different types of joints? Yeah, sure. Can I tell me? Can I tell about them? Yeah, sure. Proceed. Mo there are two types of joints: movable joints and immovable joints. Movable joints are the joints that can pro that can make movement in our bones. Immovable joints are the joints that can that cannot make movement in our bones, and we cannot control them. Can you tell me about the examples of joints? Yeah, sure. See, uh, uh, all the joints in the skull are immovable except the lower jaw bone, and there are four different uh, joints, not including the lower jaw bone. There, are ball and socket joint, which is present near the shoulder and the hip, gliding joint, which is present near the wrist and the ankles, and the hip joint, which is present in the knees and the arms, and pivot joint, which is present. Uh, in the neck. So, Alvata, do you know what are muscles? No, can you brief me about them? Yeah, sure. Muscles are tools which help our body to move. Do you know the different types of muscles? Please, can you brief me about them? I know a very little. Okay, sure. There are three different types of muscles: cardiac muscles, smooth muscles, striated muscles. Cardiac muscles always stay in motion as they those muscles help the heart to pump blood to our our body. So, uh, cardiac muscles help the heart and always stay in motion. And the next is striated muscles. They are voluntary muscles and they help us to move our body parts. So next is smooth muscles. They are involuntary muscles like breathing, thinking, etc. Okay, Alvita, this is the very good discussion we had about the skeletal system, right? Yeah, this is the very good part that we learnt already. Okay, Alvita, bye for now. Bye, Nikita.